Hey guys, um, I don't know if you can tell, but there's a slight change to the color in the tank right now, and I'm so excited, I was going to wait to get them installed correctly, but I just can't wait to show you guys, and it's because of these. These are the debated Teotronics LED, uh, Chinese LED lights. These are the new 2014 version. They're dimmable. As you can see, they don't have those switches on the sides anymore. They just have one control knob for white and one for blue. It's very streamlined. There are two fans that are incredibly quiet. And the build quality, guys, I am highly impressed. I have two of them now hanging over this the 75 gallon. These are the full spectrum. So as you can see, there's the greens, yellows, blues, whites, reds, um, the purples, uh, royal blue. There's all the colors are there, and it shows because the tank looks just incredible. So there's our. Uh, fire shrimp he's loving them he, he never used to come out this much when we had the t5s um, there's our yellow coarse grass our torch fully extended he's he's extending so much um, these guys are looking awesome the hammer is extended more than he used to be Meteor shower, Cyphastria. See if I can get it focus. You can see. Polyps are out. Our long tentacle anemone, which has embedded himself in the sand. Here's our fire shrimp. The monopora. See if I could zoom in here for you guys. So you can see polyps are out. Happy. And these lights, guys, have only been on this tank for an hour or two, maybe. And everybody's happy. Here's the bubble tipping enemy. He's loving it. Green star polyps, which have started to spread finally. Looking awesome. The frog spawn. Mushrooms fully open. Green velvets are looking good. The recordia is looking awesome. It's about time to do that second dip on the bubble. As you can see, he's actually coming out more than he used to be. Think I'm doing that treatment to try to get the hair algae out. I'm also uh, doing a kind of recoup on this Pasolipora a friend of mine had. And they were just, I guess, not getting what they needed. And they had no polyps when I got them. As you can see, they got a lot of polyp extension now. Not fully. As you can see, the little one, little uh, frag I got from my main colony and the other tank that I put in here, it has fully full extension. But these guys finally have polyps; they didn't have anything, and they're starting to look look like they're gonna make it. So that's that's good to see. But if you look at this tank, it, it's night and day difference, guys. Yeah, it gets amazing shimmer. And really, the camera get, doesn't doesn't do it justice on how good everything just looks and and glows, um, in the amazing shimmer of the light. Uh, I don't want to make this too long. Uh, I just want to show you guys because I was very very excited. Um, I'll let you know why these guys are over here. Uh, I mean, it's just very simple. I moved them from the other tank to here because I want to see if they'll host that long tentacle. Um, they've only been in here for less than a week. It usually takes them a little while to, before they host. Um, 
So we'll we'll see how that works out. And yeah, guys, that's that's the quick update. I just wanted I was just pretty excited because it looks so good. Once I get them all installed in here. Uh, the right way, I'm going to build a little stand to kind of hover them over. Right now, they're sitting at about 13 inches above the water level, uh, and they're only running at 25%, and that's because I, I want everything to get acclimated to this light uh, without burning anything out or, you know, or hurting anything. Um, I'm gonna, ultimately, I've set a, a, kind of set, settled on 8 inches is the height I want, I want to set them at. Um, yeah, 8, eight to 10. Um, anywhere in there once it's finally put together is going to be my my zone um and it should be good they're getting great spread the light's spreading not very very nicely uh and the build quality guys i'm i'm impressed it comes with a nice hanging kit and they're uh it's it, it was shipped very very nicely the packaging um i should have done an unboxing but i was just so excited but yeah guys there's a look real quick Quick update. Again, let me know what you think. Uh, rate, comment, subscribe. I'm, I I update, you know, uh, often. Uh, whenever I make any changes or additions, uh, or if anything is, you know, update worthy. Uh, if you guys have any comments, let me know. Questions, I'll be happy to ask you. These uh, came in. I bought two of them. Uh, it was a two-piece deal on eBay for two hundred and forty-six dollars. So that comes out to $123 a piece, which can't beat that. They're selling them separately for about $130, $135. But if you buy them together in one package, they came out to that. So that was a good deal. Um, all right, guys. I will uh, hopefully update this week, and I should be having some big additions. And, uh, and I'll let you know. I'll show you guys that when it, when it comes about. Talk to you later.